What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Dfan17 here coming at you guys with a brand new fan pack video. I know it's been a long time since I've posted a new video, but uh I just really wasn't getting any anything worth posting or any real fan packs really, so I figured I'd wait till I got some good fan packs to show you guys. And here I am right now with four brand new very good fan packs. So let's hop right into them. First off, we have the College of LSU. They sent a very nice little fan pack in this uh, nice purple envelope thing. So first off, they sent a little LSU coin purse. You can put your license in the front and... Uh, opens up to put your money in, your little coins in. So they sent that. Next, they did send a LSU rally towel. It says proud. I'm assuming just to uh, show their support. LSU also did send me a very nice t-shirt with the LSU logo on the little pocket there or pocket area and on the back says Tabasco Tigers sponsored by Tabasco and lastly they did send a very nice little mini bobblehead in it, it says Bob Pettit bobblehead so I'll open that up for you guys And that little bobblehead looks like this. It's very small. Um, I don't really know much about basketball, let alone college basketball. So, I mean, I don't know if he's good or not. But it's all still very cool to get a little bobblehead from them. So, thank you, LSU, for that. Next up, we are going to have one from the Cincinnati Reds. Cincinnati Reds, come on out. There you go. And they sent this very big package for I'm not sure why actually because they uh, didn't send much in it, but what they did send was quality items. So let's see. First off, they sent a very cool Cincinnati USA Reds t shirt. I don't know if it was for like Patriots Night or America Night or something like that, but they have the nice. U.S. flag there with the little Reds logo, and it was sponsored by, let's see, Toyota. And they also did send a very cool Cincinnati Reds hat with the old, uh, oh, I forget that mascot's name, what's his name? Mr. Red, with a Mr. Red logo. And it was sponsored by Fox Sports Ohio. And that is actually all that they sent, but still very quality. So, thank you for that one, Cincinnati Reds. Next up, we have a very big one from the Philadelphia Phillies. They also sent a very big package. Let's see. They sent a lot of stuff in here. Ooh. All right, so first up. The Phillies did send me a little 1990s retro night poster. Has all the some of the old players, the old stadium there. And on the back there is a looks like a uh, mock of a Rocky scene or something, but with the Phillies, <laughs> the Phillies uh, mascot. That's pretty funny. I never actually paid attention to that. Next up, they did send me some very cool ro rolls of fat heads. They sent me uh, quite a few. Jim Tomei, Tony Taylor. Uh, n oh, that one's John Crook. Crook? I don't know. That one right there is Tony Taylor. Jim Bunning. And Robin Roberts. Not quite sure who all those guys are, but 
Apparently they're all part of the Phillies Wall of Fame. So that was very cool. Next, they did send a very unusual thing. I've never seen anything like this. It is like a uh, watercolor painting almost of Carlos Ruiz and Ryan Howard. It's pretty cool. It has like a matted background. It says Pride of the Phillies on it. And uh, yeah, looks like it looks like an actual painting. I've never really opened it to see see if it is or not, but. Uh, next up, they did send a very cool blue Philadelphia Phillies visor. Have not worn that that yet, though. Pretty, pretty tight on me. And lastly, the Philadelphia Phillies did send a back-to-school kit, which is very cool. I have not opened this because, I mean, I don't really have the need to. It's got a pencil holder there. I can see a little, uh... Uh, what's that called? A notebook in the background. They got an eraser, a little tiny notebook, pencils, and in Philadelphia F Phillies folder. So, that'll be it from the Phillies. Thank you for that one. And last up, we have this massive box. Had no idea where it came from. And it doesn't really say on the label either. Um, no, it does not say on the label. But it was a very nice surprise to open it up to see that there were... It was from the Colorado Rockies and there were four bobbleheads in here. First you got D DJ LeMahieu with his... Uh, with his career high bobblehead last season. Well, well it should be two seasons ago now. But they sent the Charlie Blackman Star Wars edition bobblehead giveaway, which is very cool. Next up, they sent another Charlie Blackman bobblehead. It's just of his, uh, just him, I guess, just a stadium giveaway there. And lastly, they sent a Nolan Arenado bobblehead. Right there, that picture of him waving is the act, supposed to be the actual bobblehead. That, so, I will open these guys up. Oh, that is actually not all the Rocky sent, though. They also sent a mass lump of a ton of t-shirts. But, unfortunately, there was only two different kinds. They sent a... This was the first design, the Colorado Rockies, which is very cool. And the second design was Colorado Earth Day 2017. So that one was actually from this year. And that was sponsored by, let's see, a radio station in Colorado, I'm assuming. And they sent, oh, is there a back to that one? No, there's not. And on the, they sent about, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of those shirts, so all different sizes. And so now I will open up these bobbleheads for you to show you what these look like. And I was actually very surprised to get this fan pack from the Rockies because I. I remember sending one out to the Rockies almost a year ago, but since then, I don't remember actually ever sending one out. So, let's see. First here, we will do the Nolan Arenado one. And opened up. This is what he looks like. Him waving to the crowd there. Sponsored by Shane Co. Not sure what that is, but as you can, if you might be able to tell... He is actually standing on a base, which is very cool. He's got the pinstripe uniforms on with, what's that say? 89 XBH, MLB record for third base. That's what that says. And on this side it says, um, I cannot tell what that number is, but it says something total bases light all of the MLB. 
So that was the first bobblehead of Nolan Arenado. Let's see. Next up, we have the Charlie Blackman one. Stadium giveaway. Let's see, put that there. Which is, which is actually very cool. Right here, Charlie Blackman. He's standing on grass. Number 19. Oh, forgot. Hold on a second. Forgot his little baseball bat there. It doesn't like to stay in, but resting over his shoulder. Yep, see, it just fell out. He's got a very nice furry beard on this one, though, as you can see. And on the back, pinstripe logo, or pinstripe uniform as well. Sponsored by Country Financials. So that one was very nice as well. Set that there. Next up, I will show you the Star Wars version of Charlie Blackman, dressed as a X-Wing pilot. So, all opened up. Charlie Blackman dressed up for Star Wars night. He's got his little uniform on. Standing on a... Well, it doesn't look to be very even base, but it's cool. On the back says Star Wars Jedi Knight at Coors Field 2016. That is actually a very cool one. Thank you for that. And lastly, we have the DJ LeMayhew Career High Bobblehead, which I think is my favorite. It is him in his stance after he has swung. And he is standing there in his stance. Oh, there goes that one. Standing there in his stance. And on the base it says 348, which is his batting average for that year. And he's actually the base is actually home plate. I don't know if you can see that. There you go. It's a very cool bobblehead. It's got the bat that, that you stick in. This one's also actually sponsored by that Shane Co. Batting champion of the 2016 National League. So, that'll be it for this video, guys. Um, I mean, just, just, if you're looking for inspiration or looking for how to get better fan packs, it's really just all the luck. Luck on who you contact and what mood they're in. So, I don't know when I'll make another video. Probably not for a while because it's been, up, like I said, it's been very slow. I haven't been getting very many good ones, but... If I, if I get another box or get another good fan pack, I will definitely let you guys know. Thanks for watching, and this, is, this has been a, another video with DFAN17.